how many of you here have made something that is fashion related? Uh, not, not very many. And how many of you do work related to tech? Oh, that's great. Okay, what if you could combine fashion and technology and create something that not only expresses who you are, but it does a little extra for you? Like changing the shape or the color of your clothing? Or adjusting the temperature to keep you cool or warm? This is my world with Make Fashion. Since 2012, we have been paving the way for fashion tech by teaming up artists, designers, and engineers to imagine the future of fashion technology. We're pushing the boundaries of wearable technology, and we have learned a few things along the way. I remember our first runway show. It really was an experiment for us as much as it was for the teams. Some of the pieces had so many lights and big batteries that made them heavy, but the design was beautiful. Months later, two of the pieces from that show went viral. And soon enough, we had to pack our bags and we started doing shows in North America and China. It fascinates me to see how far we have come. Because every year, I get to see this creative process where the teams push through the challenge of bringing fashion and technology together. And going from idea to sketching, to integrating the technology, to having the piece runway ready. The amazing thing is, if somebody comes to us and says, I would love to be part of this, but I know nothing about tech, well, I can tell you that we will find a way by either teaching you or teaming you up with somebody that knows a lot about it. And we are here in Calgary, a city that is not really known for its fashion yet, let alone fashion tech. Many artists, designers, engineers, Educators are based in Calgary. From here, we have built a global community, and we experiment with designers and engineers on the other side of the world where fashion tech is growing rapidly. And this community now includes students as young as six. Our team is always researching and finding new products to lower the barrier of entry to fashion tech. Every year, LEDs become smaller and more flexible. Batteries are smaller. Making diffusers became easier with 3D printing. I am able to utilize the tools and equipment that our community has available at our makerspace to make the imaginable possible. And so this process goes both ways. Designers help to make the technology invisible, letting you see the effects of it. And engineers help to make the design come to life. All of it needs to flow and work together. Lights, sensors, diffusers, battery, all of it needs to be placed in the garment. For seven years now, I have had the opportunity to see hundreds of people go through a similar process. Artists, designers, and engineers working together and learning a little bit about an industry they weren't familiar with. And make fashion is at the heart of it. We have enabled designers to create their own products, like the first sewable LED strip. Other designer has come up with a collection of tops, dresses, and skirts that come with a detachable tech underlayer for you to easily wash them. We strive to make it easy for the teams to create fashion tech for the runway, but also to imagine what the everyday fashion could be and what it could do for you, something that could further enhance the functionality of your clothing. 
Fashion tech is going to change how we wear our clothes. It's just getting started. Our team has made a, a wedding dress for this bride right here. Inspired in the northern lights, other garments can tell a story about specific cultures and their traditions. Others can highlight elements of a dancer's suit that lights up based on their movement. Each one looks so different, and many of them tell their own story. Others are inspired and created as a social experiment when the garment goes from clear to opaque. I myself went through that process and created a garment that I called the I Heart Dress. I go through periods of anxiety, and this helped me visualize that and think of interacting with my husband, for example, so he can be aware if I need help or if I need some space. <laughs> and I'm ready to keep experimenting with new technology. I would love to be able to use AR and thinking of ways that we can be mindful of what other people around us might be going through, but we don't necessarily see. Now, imagine your clothes in your style that could change and reflect your mood. Reflect, not change, actually. Some can use EEG headsets to show how focused or relaxed you are or change the color of your outfit. Or in the medical field, it could help diabetics know their sugar levels or if you have a bad posture. Kath Flair is a, an artist and a PhD student that often works with EEG headsets. On this piece, she used an EEG headset that reads the wearer's brain waves data and triggers lights and movement in the back of the harness, making the garment alive. Or, in Angie's case, a Calgary singer and songwriter, she used an EEG headset to pulsate and change color, but also changes the rhythm of the music on her live performance. While these garments aren't all ready for you to wear every day, they are comfortable. And the day will come when you have to make sure you charge your clothes before you leave your house. <laughs> Fashion technology is now allowing us to expand the direction that wearable te technology is going. Adapted to each one of us, we can create our own fashion tech. We can prototype, innovate, we can collaborate, experiment with new technologies. We strive to make it easy for everybody to learn, to see things with a different lens. The once heavy and uncomfortable jacket, it's now light and comfortable. I encourage you to think of what the future of your fashion will be like. Think of what it could do for you, something that could further enhance the functionality of your clothing. You can collaborate with people in our global community and create something that hasn't been done before. Add that little extra that will change how we wear our clothes and interact with others. So, if you do want to try fashion tech, you know who to call. Thank you.